get ready for this creepy story. It's going to be spooky. So get ready for it. This story, this creepy story is called The Clown. Match with this the theme. Maybe this is why I have this costume. It'll go perfect with the story. Because I'm a clown. Speaking of clowns, remember that clown game I played? Um, Death Park. Remember that when I played that on my channel? Might be playing that game and doing more than one gameplay of it. Then because that one year I tried to do it, parts two and the other parts I tried to film didn't want to film. But yeah, you might, you might see that game again, but we'll see. Kelly never enjoyed anything. The doctor said, the doctor said she needed some tearing up. Or it could be bad one day. Kelly's parents took her to a dusty old toy shop for her to pick anything she wanted. She drafted through the rows of different toys, games, and bikes. Nothing here caught. Nothing here caught her eye. Then she saw it. It was a clown. A simple clown that that was giving her the peace sign. Kelly laughed and picked it up. Her parents found it, found her, and saw that she wanted the clown badly. When they got to the counter, the woman saw it and said, You had better to be careful with this one. Never leave it on its own for too long. Kelly nodded her head, nodded her head, and the parents paid for the doll. Kelly and her clown doll was rarely a, even apart. She was always playing with it and t taking it everywhere until one night. Kelly was hungry, was hungry that night. 
It was late and she didn't want to wake up her parents. So the clown doll on the table, she put the clown doll on the table in the kitchen. Then went into the fridge after she got in something to eat. Went upstairs and forgot about the doll. Kelly woke up with from a nightmare. It was about her clown. She it was about a clown. It was about her clown. She suddenly remembered that she left it downstairs. She sat up. But there was, but it was there on the end of her bed. Kelly, Kelly forward, she lay back down in her bed. Then the clown ran across her bed with the knife. It had gotten from the kitchen. Kelly's mother walked into her room. Kelly lay there dead. Her mother screamed. She ran out of the room, but she didn't notice the clown sitting there in the corner holding three fingers up. What did you think about that creepiest story? So he was holding two fingers up. And they, she thought it was doing the peace sign. That was because he killed, it was his victims. He killed two people. And then he started, at the end, he started holding three, a uh, three up. So he killed three people now. What did you think about that scary story? Let me know down in the comments below. Let's see if I can do my clown voice. <clears throat> Hello! I'm going to get you! <laughs> you better run! <laughs> <laughs> but that's my creepy voice, my creepy clown voice. But yeah, what do you thought about that story? And if you're brand new to my channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button. Tap the bell to get notified every time I upload a brand new video. Peekaboo, I see you. The creatures are coming to get you. Bye.